saying is, right, because because this is what I this is the energy that I'm feeling from B Dot. I feel like in Dot's mind, right, you can tell me if I'm wrong, I'm no psychic, but you know I'm saying I am I'm a smart individual. I feel like Dot feels like this past weekend he, he wrote some tailor made crazy shit and <coughs> the fact that people are saying it's debatable in his mind, he's like, Yo, y'all niggas is crazy. That's what they saying? Yeah, yeah, they were saying that. They were saying that. Now, I seen on the com on Twitter after y'all battle, it was heavily debated. And then in the comments, a lot of people right now they they they're going back and forth. Some people got you winning, some people got should winning. Oh, that's crazy. So, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I mean, that that's why I asked you. That's why I posed the question that I posed because, you know what I'm saying? That's the energy I got from you. Like, yo, why is you know what I'm saying what's up with niggas, but no, nah, I mean, no, nah, I, I, you know, everybody's entitled to their own opinion, that's cool. Mm -hmm. Now, I, I ain't gonna hold you, y'all better than me, man. That's why I, I, I felt back. <laughs> nah, real talk, I felt back yeah. the months because I, I just, I didn't, I didn't feel like I didn't feel the appreciation that I felt like it should have been there. You know what I'm saying? Partially, I, I still don't. That's why I'm still expect, here. I don't, I, I, don't, I don't expect, um. I don't expect to be a fan favorite with my material. You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. we're not living in a world where, like, real talk um, trumps entertainment. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. like, like actual facts. Like, if somebody built their whole brand off of being something, you know, you know, like my third round for Suge would be the equivalent if somebody caught me with a white bitch. Mm. Better make sure you're not with a white bitch. Be done. No pork on my fork. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm fucking with you. But yo. But yeah, that that's it's it's like that. So I don't, you know. Yeah. But for me, man, it don't really, you know. Listen, man, we get on stage, we rap, we get off stage, we get our second half. But but you, the reason why I'm posing this is because, like, I think I think this right here, is the biggest conversation in in the culture right now like real sick this being your homie and we ain't going to elaborate on this much but i feel like kid chaos feels like this after the danny battle like oh, for when, sure. when, I, when i reverted when i reverted when i reverted back to the i think i figured out everything in battle rap and it threw a curveball because i think he he felt like he had that shit figured out and then when that shit got was He'll never be properly appreciated. Kid Chaos will never be properly appreciated in this culture. He's mm -hmm. too much of a he's too much of a pen. Like too much of a pen. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like like he he'll never be properly appreciated. So I hope that he just get that through his head right now and just get on stage and get his bread. That's really all it come down to. Get on stage and get your bread. Go home to your family. Yeah. I mean I mean I mean to me that that that's what it's all to, to me, I understand both sides of the coin. Like it's a such thing as being, <clears throat> in general, like in, in, in hip hop period, it's a such thing of being too lyrical. I mean, it's a fault, it sounds crazy to say it, like how is this impossible, but I mean, that's how, you know, cannabis stays where he stays, and Biggie and Pac are Biggie and Pac, because they balance the boat, they balance too, and cannabis is just, you know what I'm saying, super duper crazy with the rhymes, but yeah. the, other, the other things, you know what I'm saying, it lacks, but I, I think that is, going going but, to be uh, the new conversation yeah but as an mc you got to keep your you got to keep your head space in the space of what do your peers think you know what i mean like that that's that's like kid chaos myself real sick like we rap for our peers like mm -hmm. you know i, mean? I want to get off the stage you know i've had murder move come up to me and tell me that i was incredible that's yeah. what mattered that's yeah. what mattered you know what i'm saying i've i've got i've gotten off the stage and i've had you and rain tell me things that I can't say live on this camera and you know what I'm about to say or yeah. what I would, or, you know what I'm saying? So um, those things matter more than how well do we entertain a couple people. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, um, that, that's what I strive for as an MC. And I think somebody like Kid Chaos, I think he should put his head in that mind state if he is indeed uh, bothered by his last performance or whatever you just said, I think he should yeah. just put his in the mind state of, okay, what do my peers think? Cause I went up to him after the battle. I told him he was incredible. I'm sure Danny told him he was incredible. So like, I think it's about when you have a pin like that and you're really an MC like that, you should just worry about what your peers think. Matter of fact, Papoose 
Papu said that Kid Chaos had the bar of the weekend. Mm. So, you know what I mean? So, like, mm. what are we talking about if a couple fans mm. said he lost or said he was whack? Like, Papu said he had the bar of the weekend. Like, this is what matters to real MCs, bro. Like, we don't, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, it's crazy, like, to, to really um, let your, put your talent in the hands of the average person just sitting at home and let them tell you that you whack. Like, nah, bro, you special. You brilliant. Let yeah. the brilliant, let the other brilliant people tell you that you brilliant, you know? No, I definitely, I definitely understand what you're saying. For me, I, I just, I just, I, I, I guess I tread on, on both, and, and 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 it was for particular reasons. Like I feel like now I'm, I, I still don't feel like I reached the highest form of level that I'ma reach, but I'm getting there. But that's only yeah. because that's only because the situation changed, and I mean, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like that plays a big part in part in it too. Yeah, you know what I'm saying like in terms of, for me, just because I'm used to 2,000, 1,500, you know what I'm saying. So, yeah. now that now that now that that shit goes down, it's like, all right, cool. I don't gotta worry about that. The only thing I was saying to Kid Chaos though is that I don't I I don't want niggas to get trapped in because there's no room. Let me go to a level where niggas can't understand what's going on. I like that, man. I like that, personally. Nah, you want you want to know why that? Because I feel like, right. And I'll give you a prime example, right? Like, I'm going to ask y'all this question. Just, just y'all keep it real. My Geechee or Av material, which ones y'all feel is better? F. F. Now, see, if, if if we basing it on writing, my Geechee material is better. Mm, okay. You okay. see what I'm saying? So it's like, okay. so it's like, do I, do I get stuck in that position of, Yo, let me just worry about writing, cause in 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 the Geechee battle, Danny Danny's hitting me up. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I caught that. That's crazy. Light is hitting me up. You hitting me up? Yo, that shit was crazy. Sit. Kid Chaos is tweeting. Yo, DNA second is crazy. But to the average fan, they not understanding nothing that I'm saying. It's like it's a bunch of in the chats. What the fuck is DNA talking about? And then with Av, I just make it so one like it's not one two three, but it's a. Uh, it's more in front of your face. Exactly. It's a decision, man. It's, exactly. it's at the end of the day. It's a exactly. It's, it's, exactly. It's, it's, good, good way you said that, sick. It's more in front yeah. of your face. It's, yeah. st it's still breakdowns and doing all that shit, but it's like, all right, here. And I only did that because I know who I'm going against. I'm like, yo, if I try to do this encrypted shit with Av, it's but a nigga see, that's gonna... But see, it's a decision, though, D, because it's like when we get in a circle of, like, a circle of MCs and we get to talking this shit, like, let's say it's me, you, sick. Mm-hmm. Chaos. I'm trying to name all the pins. JC, Chilla, Lux, Daylight. Daylight. Yeah. Let's say if we all all in a circle just talking about our careers and shit. Like, ain't that where you want it to count? Like, don't you want to hear us tell you that you incredible and that we caught everything that you was trying to do? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, from yeah. an MC perspective, like, yeah. I think that that matters but, but the you, most. But you, but you want to know what's so crazy? At the same time, though, that chat and, and just the... Right, right, right. It's like you painting a beautiful picture. And if that shit goes, like, for me, that's what I struggle with. If that goes under the rug, it's like, damn, I painted this picture for nothing. So that's the part that weighs on me. Like, yeah, B dot so I painted it. But you didn't paint it for nothing. That's what I'm saying. Like, why Like why so much value got to be placed on somebody at home hearing you rap, hearing you rap on the spot for that first time and them not yeah. catching anything? Like, so what? Like, so what? Because... The niggas that do it on a high level caught everything, and then yeah. hopefully that, that hopefully that supposed fan has enough uh, appreciation for you that they go back and really listen to what you have to say. And if they don't go back and really listen to what you have to say, they're not your fan anyway. So who cares? Yeah, yeah. But but the crazy part yeah. is that that's the tough part about it because I still feel like all right, yo. Even though we are doing it to reach the highest level, it's still a form of entertainment, and we're still doing it. As much as we want to say we're doing it for us, we're still doing it for them. Because the moment, because the, the moment, because the moment, now nah, you're right. But the moment that they say we don't want to see it no more, you might not get paid. You see That's what I'm saying? Cap. That's cap. Shout out to Verb. That's cap. Here we go. Here we, here we go. <laughs> this nigga. Yo, this, I ain't going to lie. This nigga's on one today, man. That's cap. This That's nigga's cap. on one. Niggas get booked. Niggas get booked. So you know what I'm saying, like, and, and, and I'm gonna be. I, I, but I'm gonna. I've but, but graduated I'm, to in this culture. Like, I, I've I've understood that once you already got your brand, once your brand set in stone, whether they whether the people love you or hate you, whether you the hero or the villain, 
you're gonna you're gonna get booked if you got a brand to sell you're gonna get booked your dna you're a legend in the culture you're gonna get booked if you choose to go into the stratosphere and go to the cosmos with your writing and they don't catch it they don't catch it you're gonna get booked your dna yeah but i'm saying i'm not now i'm not saying for me about getting booked i'm saying about other people it, it'll get to a point if you go two 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 and people are just not receiving it before brand, if you have no no, no brand, but i'm saying you before you get to that brand like somebody that's going to mm. come up that people love but they they're not stapled in like they can they can come today pause go tomorrow that's what i'm saying with with that with me it comes from a standpoint of <clears throat> and i guess that just comes from the stage like you know what i'm saying if you erase dna on all those stages dna being at the bt awards all of that shit, we take that out of my career then i guess that never weighs in the back of my mind it just goes all right i'm gonna just go to that level but me knowing that and knowing that at some point in time to get to where i'm at i had to cater and switch and do all of that it's just the gear that i that i that i turn on now way more than i did before but sometimes i i like me i, I i've always felt like the part about being lyrical too is being able to put that shit in a certain way that people can catch it. Now, everybody's not going to catch it, but I feel like it's also an art in being able to make people understand yeah. the high level it's shit. Between, it's between the shit that can stand the test of time and the shit that people are going to get in the moment, right? Yeah. You got to find a... So, like, my material versus Mike, let's say. In the moment, people in the room... I was shaking that room of 20, 30 people. You but was. it was also very lyrical. I was right. Mm -hmm. Almost everything I said damn near rhymed. You know what I mean? So you can find a way. There's secrets. You know what I mean? Yeah. Little special moves you could do to like, make like, the like, shit. Right, I'm going to give you a prime example, right? The reason why I'm saying this with Dot, right? Now, I'm, I'm sure maybe you notice, know maybe you don't. Mm -hmm. Dot's, Dot's trick, even if you don't understand what he's saying, is his flow pattern. The way he's rhyming. I might not understand, like, I'm not saying me, I'm saying to the average fan that's watching it, the reason why it's digestible is because he puts it in a way that I just fuck with the way he's rhyming. The in and out, all of that. Why, so, that's so, why I said secret DNA, yeah. but like you just gave it away. So now. <laughs> this nigga's crazy. This nigga's so crazy. Now, like, now I gotta find something else, but all right. Nah, nah, I'll fuck it with nah, you. nah, nah, yeah, nah. Yeah. I'm, I'm saying, I'm, nah, I'm saying, I'm saying, same thing with you, sick. The, <laughs> yeah. the pattern and the way you approach, you know, what I'm saying the bars. Even if I don't understand it, I'm intrigued by the way it's going. All right, the yeah. da 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 da. da. I'm, what I'm saying is, certain yeah. people don't have that. That's the right. problem of where. Absolutely. Now, 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 I can't digest it and I can't get there. That's when it becomes, you know, what I'm saying tricky. Oh, and they said the unpresented, the un. Whatever, precedented whatever, rhyme yeah, patterns. Whatever yeah. that shit is. Whatever yeah, that yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, the very the, the precedented though. Yeah, the it's precedent. You know what I mean? I ain't gonna lie though, man. I love B Dot, but, but but this new energy I like from him, man. It's like <laughs> nah, right now, right now, Dot Dot is pop when he went to death row. You on you on bullshit live? right now. Man, listen, you, you you what's 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 that famous quote? You live long enough to become the villain. Yeah. You know what I mean? And yeah. it's like <clears throat> for me. I just got to get to a point where, um, or, I, or I've gotten to a point where it's like, bro, you know, you're not going to, everybody not going to like you, dog. You know, yeah, like, as, a as, a, as, a, as a Pan-African, as, as a person that tries to speak out for black liberation, you want to you wanna be able to touch everybody, right? And try to affect everybody. And then you got to hit a point where like, okay, you in this battle rap shit and this shit entertainment. Everybody not going to like you. Everybody not going to fuck with you, dog. So mm -hmm. stop trying to please everybody. Stop trying to get on these cameras and be so humble. And, oh, yes, I'm just so grateful for the opportunity. I think I'm going to beat him 2-1. No, nigga, 3-0. Fuck you. Run it. You know what I mean? Like, you just got to get to a different place with this shit. Like, like who cares, bro? Like, the, like people going to love you or hate you. The people that love me know my heart, know what I stand for. They support me. They buy my Elevate merch. You know what I'm saying? They they stream my music, and then the casual fans is gonna be on some. If I impress them that night, they'll show love. If I don't, then it's fuck be that. And um, that's you got you just got to get to a point where that's okay. Like that's part of the game. That's part of the game. You got to be able to just be like, I'm here to rap. I'm here to impress my peers. I'm here to impress my opponent more than anything. You know what I mean? So that's just where I'm at with it, man. And and you know it's early as fuck. So you know I just woke up, nigga. Yeah, now nah, I know, but 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 I could just yo, I could tell, man. Yeah. Like the same way, the same way I, I, I know y'all. 
Yeah. My energy don't lie. I, I wear yeah. my energy on my sleeve, man. Yeah, exactly. So, so you know, I know when I'm seeing it, I'm like, yeah, man, this is this is Shug when he bailed Pac out. He got the money from Death Row, and that nigga was me against the world. I like man. that. Yeah. I like that. You know what I'm saying? That's that's the energy I'm seeing. Sick over here, just yo, man. DNA's DNA's over here saying too many secrets, man. Yo, sick. Yo, sick. Gonna balance me out though. We gonna be straight. Yo, sick. So after after the, after. The, <laughs> <laughs> Yo, sick. Yeah, let we, me ask we, you. Yeah, we good. So, one thing. Uh, yo, you breaking up, sick? What's up? Yo, can you hear me? Can you hear me? We good? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We good. Go ahead. Um, oh. Oh. Should I leave and come back? You can Stop. hear me. Nah, nah. You good, you good right now? You good now. We good, we good. Mm-hmm. All, right, all right, my bad. Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm at. Uh, yeah, I'm not at home right now. The Wi-Fi is kind of fucked up, but uh, nah, so good. Uh, what what were you saying, bro? My bad. Nah, I, uh, what I was about yeah. to ask you was, I said, um, when you actually after the battle with Mike P, that conversation that you had was, and I'm saying, mm-hmm. did because I know before now, now I don't like me. I say a lot of shit that be true in my face off when when I was in my face off bag. I, I really don't be in that bag no more. I just get to <laughs> right, the battle. Right. But Mike P was saying a lot of things yeah. like he'll be surprised if you could hang, if you could, you know what I'm saying? So after that battle, what was that conversation? Was the respect there? Like, you know what I'm saying? Sick, you impressed me. Yeah. I put the respect absolutely. on your name or was it still, you know what I'm saying? Okay. <laughs> Yo, yeah, I'm I'm laughing at you, chat. My bad. Your chat is wild. Yeah, they wilding right now. My chat is always crazy, <laughs> they, they bro. <laughs> Yo, Doc, yeah, they but, think uh, you went to sleep over there. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, he might have, man. <laughs> Yo, Doc, you good? <laughs> Can you hear us? Did he freeze? He might have froze. Nah, bro. Damn, that's crazy. <laughs> uh, that, that nigga be that knocked out, man. Oh, nah, he just woke up. Yo, this nigga's crazy, bro. Yo, as soon as I... I, I ain't trying to have him on here looking crazy, so I just took the screen off. The nigga sat up like the Undertaker. Yo, man, only on breakfast with the champ, man. Oh, my... Bruh. Yo, Doc. <laughs> yo, hey. Yo, Doc. Yo, you know how... You know how yo, that's how you know I love you. When I thought you went to sleep, I x you off. I said, yo, I'm not going to hey. have my man on the screen looking tired. Nigga rose up like the Undertaker. <laughs> Hey, you think y'all niggas still finna go to sleep on my children? Yo, battle rap is a crazy world, bro. That's nah, crazy. nah, when we seen you like that, I'm like, yo, they like, yo, I'm this nigga. Chilling, is- man. I'm chilling. You ask the question. I'm chilling. Nah, I'm chilling. I know. Yeah. But once I once I seen once I seen these niggas over here saying it, I'm like, yo, damn, is this nigga sleep? And then when I'm wow. saying it and you ain't saying nothing, I'm like, yo, that's my man. I ain't gonna have I'm not gonna have him on the show <laughs> sleep. So I X this shit out. When, I, when I'm Xing it out, I just see the nigga rise up like the Undertaker. I'm like, yo, this nigga is crazy. I told you shit was spooky. Yo, that, yo, y'all, yo, that yo, the name of y'all group got to be Scary Hours, man. <laughs> yo, that's kind of dope, too. That's fire, Yeah, right. we, we I, got... Uh, I Dyer, fuck with real rap, though, man. Yeah, real rap, but rap is W-R-A-P. Oh, real yeah, that's rap. fire, too. That's fire, yeah, too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, my bad, what was your question, bro? <laughs> the end of my third, you were saying something? Yeah, nah, I was saying... Oh, the conversation Yeah, after. the conversation yeah. with Mike. Like, the, yeah. I mean, of course, don't... You know what I'm saying? Don't spell like, you know what I'm saying, certain shit. But yeah, yeah I'm just saying overall. The re- that's the reason I was so calm in the face offs, man. Like, okay. like I knew I knew what I had. Like, like that's not that's not all that loud. Like I figured Mike out in my mind. So like when he was screaming and shit like that, to me in my head, I it just looked like he was panicking. It mm. didn't look like how, you know, it, and and the chat kind of went like that. From what I was, from what I was told, like in the beginning, it was, yeah. oh shit, Mike is barking, talk, talk. And yeah. then after a while, it was like, yo, he's talking a little too much. Like why now he looks like people were saying he was on Adderall and shit. You know what I mean? But no, nah, I think, I think to me, before the battle, that's just what it looked like. He was nervous. <laughs> he was anxious or something. You know what I mean? Like I, I, I don't know what it was, but uh, yeah, I, I had him figured out. That shit didn't phase me. You know what I mean? But after the battle, yeah, it was mutual respect. And um, 
to to add on to like the conversation we was having earlier about uh about uh you know like the the impact like the longevity of of the way your shit gets received the the one thing i'm learning especially with my third round is that like like that type of material like s like sending a message you know what i mean that shit is important and that shit to me is is more important than everything else yeah you know what i mean cuz like now uh i know y'all aren't familiar with like the singers in the indian singers and shit like that but a lot of a lot of famous ones i'm talking people that got 180 million views on youtube and shit were retweeting that clip you know what i mean and mm. it's it's spreading the message which which is crazy you know what i mean fire but uh yeah <laughs> no that's definitely, that's definitely fire um somebody in the oh, chat man. said somebody in the chat said my wife loves indian music <laughs> Shout out to her, bro. Nah, but yo, but nah, sick. I, I I respect the fact, and I and I always said this from the beginning when we first started. You know, what I'm saying talking mm -hmm. and building. Um, that I what I, what I respect about you the most is that you know what I'm saying you could just see, no matter how successful you are in this shit, you still willing to learn to keep reaching that next level, which is the most impressive part to me because some people mm -hmm. start. You know what I'm saying? Getting those wins and getting that recognition and the fans showing love and it goes to their head. And that's why they, they, they drop as quickly as they rise. Opposed to, you know what I'm saying, somebody like you, no matter where <clears throat> the status is, you know what I'm saying, your mind stays with, yo, what can I do to improve? How can I elevate this? Cause, Always. Because it's going to go from I love you to I hate you. Yeah, and you yeah. know what I'm saying? Before we can get to I love you again, certain people don't stand that test of time. So they uh, you know what I'm saying? They get they get out of here. My man Dot, my man Dot is in the zone right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I appreciate that, dear. You know but, what I'm uh, saying? Cause yeah. I, I I've seen it when they I've seen it when they loved me. I was there when they hated me, loved me again, hated me again. Love we, we we got we got an abusive relationship. Me and Battle Rap. So right, right, you know what right. You I'm saying? Right, right. One day it could be get the fuck out the house. We never want to see you again. And the next right. day is yo, please stay, man. So you know yeah. what I'm saying? That's how this shit goes, man. Yeah, I'm starting to learn that. But yeah, after every battle, even if I go crazy, I'm going to ask, yo, any criticism? Anything I should do? What do you think? You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm just trying to get better and better and better. Yo, somebody in here said, act sick about Charlie Clips. I don't I don't know why. Why? I don't what know. About, what about Clips? I, I don't know. <laughs> I, <laughs> yeah, if, like you're, I, if, if you're asking if i would battle clips yeah i'd battle i'd battle anybody i think i think me and dot uh i know people wanted to see me and dot i don't know if me and dot are gonna battle i don't think we will um, never yeah because that's that's we're, we're mad cool now you know what i mean so like your only i mean us as a two-on-two -two is gonna probably be better than us battling anyway you know what i mean we're, we're gonna be great as a two-on-two -two. i'm like great you know what i'm saying so yeah, uh, I don't know. I'm just going off the yo. This chat is wild. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, bro. This shit only here, bro. This shit is toxic yeah. over here. But yo, I got, I got, I got, I got one. Um, 